minutes late. I'm two minutes late. Let's see who's going to come on. Hello, everybody. How are you? I hope you're having a great start of your weekend or just a great day. So I got. So we're going to uh, tonight. I'm going to fix these carousels, change them up a little bit, put some new things on, take some stuff out, you know, because that's what we do on YouTube. You know, we do this. We try to choose things and wear a lot, wear them a lot, you know, so we're using our fragrances more. That's what we try to do. <laughs> hey, Kelly. Hey, Courtney. That's what we try to do. So I'm about to go through, look through all the stuff, say what I'm going to put back, put some things back, put some new things in. I don't know if I'm going to make super duper changes. I probably will. Um, And we'll talk about everything. Hey, Rochelle, we'll talk about the stuff that I'm taking off and everything. Now, let me just see say this with all sincerity i am not here to do the whole oh i'm not wearing it enough i have to get rid of it hi cat i'm not i'm not here for that conversation at all but we are gonna make some changes because you know some things i'm just not feeling right now and so it's time to let them sit on the go back to the um my shelves and then put something else out that I might want to wear. I think that um, I have found <sighs> sometimes the whole trying to like do everything like that can be quite um, stressful. Uh, but it does give me a little focus. Do I do I wear everything that I pull out? No, absolutely not. But it does give me focus and make me think, okay, let's look here first before we start looking for something else to wear, right? That's where I go with it. That's why I do the trays. I don't say that I'm going to wear everything that I pull out on these trays. I absolutely do not. But at least it gives me some focus on a daily basis so that when I'm trying to get ready in the morning, I look over here as opposed to going looking over there and just going, oh, shit. <laughs> All right. So... Now, before we get started, what we, there's a couple ways we could do this. We could start on the carousels now. You all can tell me how y'all want me, how I should do this. Or I got some fragrances, a couple of, of three fragrances that came in today. So do y'all want to see the fragrances first and then do the carousels? Or do you want me to do the carousels and then do the fragrances? Your call. Let me know what you want me to do. I wait. I see it's 11 people in here. The only people who said hello to me, though, is Courtney, Rochelle, and Kelly. Where the rest of you people at? Y'all can type good hello. Ain't nothing wrong. Hey, I'm not logging off. I've just been on for, no, I've just been on for three minutes and 33 seconds. So you're on time today. Hello, JC. Oh, and Kat was here too. She said fragrances first. Don't make me call you by your full name. So I was I have decided this year that I was gonna spend my money more with smaller brands. You know, because we can buy all these large brands, but I decided buy some. Thank you for telling me that. Cause see, I don't even see the likes when I'm on StreamYard. Hey, Dre. Um, so, um, so I'm trying to like, before I spend some money, want to buy some things from some smaller brands. So I purchased because, and there was some sales. I should have bought another something, but I didn't. I did good because I didn't go over. I didn't do too much because there was a there's a few brands I want to try, and I I will talk about the brands I want to try, and the fragrances I want to try from them soon. But here's where I got from today. I bought from Dawkins Aroma. 
So I got a full size because, you know, we, we had this whole discussion about this whole, my issues with buying discovery sets and stuff. And it, but then I did buy, what I wanted to buy is I wanted to buy some body oils to try, but the ones I wanted in body oils were sold out. Now, Dawkins does original ones and they do, and you know, dupes. Um, <laughs> I'm not even putting that down. I'm not even putting that up there because of all that Leo legacy mess. Um, so I wound up buying, hello. So I wound up buying a couple of, um, spray, travel spray, you know, decants because they didn't have the oils because I was going to try to buy oil and then I was going to buy, you know, and I was buying the fragrance. So I'm talking a whole lot to say I bought fragrances. I didn't get oils because I didn't want to buy any dupes. You know, I was like, I don't want no damn dupes. So I wasn't looking for that. What I wanted to try were their actual fragrances. So let's get started. So I bought this. Now, and I, they very good pricing. These are, these are 50 mils, nicely put together. Um, with the sale, it was real inexpensive. So they come in a little can. And then this is Black Rose. Y'all, I am in love with this thing. It is a plummy patchouli rose, rose patchouli. And it is sexy and good. I sprayed this on earlier. Black Rose is Black Rose it up for me, honey. Yes. It made me think of like, um, the, what is it? What's the song I'm thinking of? The Rose by Aretha. Roses black in Spanish hollow. That one, whatever the name. I can't think of the name of it. But you know what I'm talking about. Black rose. This is sexy. It's cause and the plum. First off, we know I love plum. So a plum note is gonna almost get me every time. Except for that nasty ass Montal dark purple that everybody told me was gonna smell so good, but it smelled like, you know, Miss Miss Carrie's musty um living room. But we're not gonna talk about that. Um, but this one is a good plummy rose with and patchouli plummy rose. Okay, enough of that. Then I got this one. Cashmere Tonka. <sighs> Want to try a rose in Spanish Harlem? That rose is still a rose. That was that was older Aretha. That's when I was like, I was no. I'm talking about classic Aretha, a rose in Spanish Harlem. Thank you, JC. I appreciate you. All right, so they do five mils, nicely done, nice look. Okay, and um, th she's out of North Carolina, I think. I don't know. On the East Coast someplace. Oh, I might need this in a full size, y'all. Okay. It's giving cashmere. It's giving Tonka. Got a little vanilla in it. Mmm. I kind of like her. It's kind of nice. Because some uh Jessica sent me uh decants of their bananas brulee. Everybody was talking about it this summer. I don't know. I don't want to smell it smell like banana laffy taffy. Everybody wanna smell like that. That's not something I want to smell like. So I would I really was not into it. But this right here, but honestly, I think this is like uh, it's kind of a it's a softer, kind of cashmere tonka vanilla vibe. I honestly think this would be pretty good. Not now. I think like maybe in the beginning of fall, early spring, or just spring in Chicago, because spring in Chicago is cold as hell. So that is cashmere and tonka. And then I bought um I don't know why I'd be keeping it. Hey Anisha. Then I got this one. And uh, supposedly this is super popular too. Pink cotton. Hey Mark. So I got pink cotton and I'm, look at this, look at these little, 
And then I got pink cotton. So let's see how this one smells. Now, you know, pink cotton sounds like something that I might might be a little too sweet. Uh, Cashmere Talk is by Dawkins Aroma. So these are all by Dawkins Aroma. Oh, this is good. Mm. Okay. It's giving good hair grease vibes. With a little sweetness. It's sweet. Mm. Kind of marshmallowy. Damn, I might like uh, all three of these. Well, I might want. Let's see, I don't need to buy no other big bottles. You see, I'm trying to talk myself out of it. Let me say this. Hey, QM, don't let there be a sale. That's all I'm saying. Don't let there be a sale. So, yeah, I got the Dawkins Aroma and Pink Cotton, Cashmere and Tonka, and Black Rose. This Black Rose is giving, 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 giving. I mean, I'm just being honest with myself. Is this, if there's a sale, I'm probably going to buy it. <laughs> hey, Sabrina. All right, so now let's talk about the carousels. Because this is my attempt to be, you know, very YouTube proper. Which means, you know, we do things like this. <laughs> like I said earlier, you know, we do this. Because we're trying to, like, rotate our fragrances Ooh, a high speed car chase. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about what I'm taking off. We're gonna talk about it and I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna put back on. Some of the stuff is staying on. So I'm gonna take off Ombre de Noir by Aaron Beauty. And the reason why is because I didn't wear it recently. I don't know why I didn't get to it. I just didn't. No excuses. I don't need to make no damn excuses. I just didn't wear it. Um, but it's a really nice, clean, ambery vibe. But it's just not... Listen. It's about to get cold here in Chicago. And when it's cold, you need fragrances that can snatch... That can hold on. Because the wind chill factor can snatch a fragrance real quick. So you want to wear stuff that's got a little, you know, it's got a little, it's got a little depth to it. You know, it, it can hold its own. And it, it ain't, um, how many Aaron perfumes do I own now? I own one, two, three, four, five, six, maybe seven. I think I own seven. I own seven of them now. So yeah, so this is a very classy, this is a classy ladies dinner perfume. I've not been a classy lady going to dinner, so that's probably why I haven't been wearing it. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, my goodness, my goodness. <laughs> okay. So this one I'm definitely putting away. It's because it's still challenging me and I just, I can't, I'm, I'm still challenged by it. And that is Perry Ellis' Oud Black Vanilla Absolute. I'm still challenged by it. Right. There we go. There we go. You, you're right. Um, even though I'm starting to like it more, so I'm going to let it sit again and then I'm going to get back to it. Um, because I still, I'm feeling challenged by it. Uh, I don't know if we're getting snow yet. We might be. If y'all get snow on Sunday, we probably get snow on Saturday, tomorrow, because it usually moves this way. All right, so we're going to put that one away. We're actually going to put away this other Aaron. Um, I don't know if it leans mascul masculine, really. I don't know. I just haven't been able to, like, get a feel for it, hold on to it, and be like, yes, I want to try it. So that's, I don't, I can't even say that. All right, so then. This is Tuberose Le Soir by Aaron. And the only reason I'm putting this one up is because it is another one that I feel is a little bit, it's just not 
strong enough for the cold weather. I think it's lovely. Mm, this is a really pretty tuberose, but I, I think it, I, I think it's not going to hold up in these in these Chicago streets. Yeah, I'm not. It's not. It's not. It's just going to be like what? Right. Then we're going to put up Scarlet Rouge because Scarlet Rouge is a very delicate cherry almond cherry blossom fragrance. And so this she's too delicate for wintertime. She's too delicate. She's a little, you know, she's delicate. She's she just can't handle. She's not going to handle things. Um right? So spring list dropping. Honey, spring, you know spring in Chicago ain't until like mid May if I'm lucky. Uh So you know, you, I just have to be honest with myself. This stuff is like, it's not going to work too well this time of year. It's just not. All right, so I'm going to put up Bois d'Amand, mainly because of that, too. These are like good fragrances, but they're just, they're not going to hold up. They're just not going to hold up. I, nothing against them. They're just not going to hold up to this, this type of weather. This weather will be like, it'll be like, no. Mm -mm. Right. Exactly. They need a little weight. These ain't weighty enough right now. <sighs> this is Tanjura Nui by Isabe. This might be able to hold its own, but I'm not sure about this one because it is, you know, it is rose with a little, is it almond? Yeah, I think it's rose and almond. I don't know. I don't think it's got enough. I don't think it's got enough to hang out. I don't think it's got enough, y'all. Now, one that does is jewelry. I'm keeping this one out because, you know, this is spices and honey. A good honey, spicy one. They they're gonna be fine, <laughs> and plus kajals don't play. So jewelry staying. Oh, I'm I'm gonna try cashmere. See how it does in the winter time. This is a uh, dream house of curio. I'm gonna keep that one out. I think I'm gonna put this one back. Sean Cohen. Yeah, this is too delicate, too powdery, too mm-mm, mm-mm. No, it, it's going to die. It's going to die. Um, and then we're definitely keeping up Overture because Overture don't play. Overture does not play. Oh, my surges are staying out. So my or Fleurs de Angers definitely staying out because... Right, you see? Right, so Dream Dream House of Kira, they gonna stay on you. I'm definitely keeping out Rose Anatomy because this one is sexy. But then again, I don't, I don't know how much I've been using of it, and this and you can't see nothing in this one. But I think I'm gonna change it up for Black Rose. Mm. Or maybe I'll just keep them both out. No, nah, bees and butterflies still, it, the vibe of bees and butterflies is more spring and summer because the, um, the honey in that one isn't too, um, it's not as, it's not as thick as some honey. So bees and butterflies. So I think I'm putting out black rose, definitely black rose is coming out. Now, this is the new La Entre D. This is Rouge Ultime. Now, any, not any of these will last. I think I'm going to give us a little more time because I think I want to do some more, um, just a little more. Do I even have chocolate fragrances? Why am I acting like I do? Um, but I think I want to wear this a couple of more times because I really do enjoy this. Hey, Valencia, because it's, it's different than the, the Rouge. 
And I think this is going to be my La Entrede for this season right now. I was thinking about changing it to Intense, but I don't think I am. Then I'm going to keep out Yasmina by Kajal, because I'm still feeling the Kajals. And she's a sexy Jasmine, you know, Yasmina. Yes. Now, I'm going to put up Orchata Divani. I think this would be fine at this time of year. Yeah. Scratch that. I'm leaving it out. I don't know. I just smelled it and it just did something for me, y'all. It just did something for me. It did. It made me feel tingly and good all over. <laughs> okay, I think we'll put up Mardella. This is one of my dream house materials because I got a bunch out right now. So I'm put up Mardella. I'm gonna keep out ghost ghost dance in the mood. Uh, I think I'm put up Evelyn Cecile for now. I'm keeping out. Uh, Corinna's de Toussaint because I just like a really interesting floral in the winter time. Uh, Opiu, vanilla Opiu, definitely is keeping out because these are like, oh, yes. Oh, I have brought you flowers. I'm putting this away because, yeah. But, oh, I love that one already. And then, what is this one? Chaconiac. <gasps> one Chaconiac and that one smell good together? We're going to have to try that. Chaconiac with the Rouge Hotel team. That chocolate and this. Oh, we're going to try that one. Okay, so those are the ones I'm keeping. All right. We'll keep that out. Kashmiri. We'll keep that one out. And then I'll put these back. Okay, so let me put these back. And then we're going to take some more off. Because I'm trying to, you know, because my issue is always putting things away. So we're going to put some stuff away. <laughs> Only this many before I bust something. Come on, sit up right. All right. <sighs> okay. Let me put these back away where they go. And then we'll take some more out and figure out what we're going to put in. Oops. Do not bust your things. Rest goes down here. Search up down here. Over here, hold on, I'm right back, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. All right, I was, I was samples. All right, I started pulling out some of them, put in because I saw them. Okay, so what do I have over here? Okay, so this is definitely staying out. Mystic Incense. Definitely keeping this one out. You're not feeling my camera angle. <laughs> this is definitely staying out. This is Andalusian Soul. Because I just got this one recently. <laughs> and I really... <laughs> and we, I think it can hold its own in this, this weather. Uh... 
I think I'm gonna put up Jasmine exclusive because I've been wearing the hell out of this one, y'all. I've been wearing this. The sample side, I have been I listen, I was working today on the samples. I got most of them put away. They were they're not quite as bad as I thought. Um with the, with organizing them, they're not quite as bad as I thought. But once again, I really did need to go through them because I have a lot of samples that I could have been using. Um, I don't, I think maybe not. We're going to see though. We're going to see how. I know she's so good. She's so, this is so good. Ha. Ah. Ooh, this is like, who am I kidding? I'm leaving it out. You're right. What am I doing? What am I doing? But I think I'm going to put Tonka Cola away. I think I'm going to put Tonka Cola away. Mm -hmm. This is getting better with age. Don't you love how fragrances get better with age? And this is getting better with age. Mm. I don't know, y'all. I, I, I don't want to have to stay out. Okay, so I'm going to put Musket Garden away. And the only reason why is because I'm still going to keep out Lovely Garden. I'm keeping out that. Hey, Desmond. I am keeping out. So we're going to put away Musket Garden. <sighs> yeah, I'm I'm doing good. I'm about to do good. sweet oriental dream. Even though this is like a powdery almondy vibe, baby, this will last on your skin. This will last on your skin. So that one's staying out. Um where is my phone? Uh, okay, you do. Thank you. Now, I might put up a vanilla ecstasy because really, this is for me to like wear with apricot fragrances. And I don't know if I'm gonna be wearing any. Well, I am. Strike that. Okay, I'm gonna think about this one. Feels de joie. Feel this why I'm keeping it out because I started wearing it and damn, I really do, really do like this honeyed jasmine bomb. Yeah, I, I, it's staying out. I'm I'm gonna wear some more. And then this one is La Dantus in Cage. I'm trying to decide on this one. I'm not sure if I'm fit, be in the mood for this one. Yes, feels the wise fire. I'm not sure if I'm being in the mood for this one right now, but we're going to keep her out. Because I might. I might just be feeling it. So there we go with that one. All right. So I'm putting this one up. Uh, Kelly, you might be right that Andalusian Soul might be better for spring the early spring because i'm gonna do some changes um in around early spring you know i'm not doing transition but i'll be I, I can do it's well i guess it is a little more transition then because the beginning of it's still cold but it's not not quite as cold right you can't right you can't never go wrong with some social talk um so I'm gonna put this one away because it might not be able to hold it. it you're right, it might not be able to. So I might have to put this one away. And I think I'm gonna put Mystic Incense. I'm gonna put Mystic Incense away. So I'm gonna put these two away. Kind of funny thing is, I don't know where I'm putting all these damn things. Because some of them, some of them just really don't have a spot right now. Because I got them late. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Reem Acre, I'm going to put away. 
I still didn't wear it, but I love this fragrance. I love this fragrance. Okay, so we're we're gonna put that one away. So let me put this back. And I'll straighten all this out in a minute. And then we're gonna keep this one out, this one out. Put that away. We're gonna put we're gonna keep take. It smells like I like strong incense though. <laughs> if it smells like that to you, that's even better than me because I like a good strong incense -y smell. But it's like a honey jasmine incense. All right, so this this so Tonka Cola is getting put away in Musky Garden, Musky Garden. And then I'm gonna try to figure out where I'm putting these other ones. It. <laughs> Let me put this away. All right. It is a very extremely strong jasmine. All right, so let me, I'm trying to pull some things out for y'all. All right. No, it's really not. Um, it's really not. I'm going to put Dama Bianca away because uh, more for the springtime. You know, she's giving spring vibes. She's giving spring vibes. Dream House is about to have a sale. So if you all are not on his mailing list and did not or did not catch the, the email, he is going to have a sale from the 10th through the 28th of this month. He's bringing out maybe two new fragrances. And after that, he is not going to be the his his site is going to go down for a while um, for personal reasons. I don't know what they are. And then you'll only be able to purchase from him uh, from Perfumology for a few months, just so you are aware of that. So get your coins together and get your fragrances because you got from the 10th to the 28th to go on and get some stuff from him. All right, so I'm going to put these away. This is Don't Explain. These are my Kai fragrances. This is Don't Explain. This is Really Into You. And this is No Ordinary Love. And that's because these are just, <laughs> just a little, I don't know, though. this is this orange blossom. Um, but this is because these are a tad more summer, spring and summer to me, especially spring. Um, hey, Chantel, how are you? So I'm going to put those away only to put, bring out some more kind of fragrances. So we're going to put those away. Let's see what else I'm going to put away. I am not putting um, two rows in Periel away because I'm still feeling her. I'm still feeling her. I'm not putting my pure jasmine away. I finally did it upside down. I got a little dim in her. I'm not because I just can't go wrong with pure jasmine. Plus the whole pistachio vibe we're having right now. We're having a pistachio moment. So I'm not going to take it away. I am, you know what, even though I've been wearing this one, I'm going to put this one away because this would work. Is Rouge Saray because I want to make some room for some other things. So even though I could be wearing this still because Rouge Saray has been giving for me right now. I have worn a few times. And them plums and them dates has been doing it for me. But I'm going to put it away for a minute because it might come back in the early spring. You know what I'm saying? It might re do a reappearance in the early spring. Because, yes, I own a lot of things, but I, these are the ones that I'm kind of feeling this season. And let's remember this. We go, we can be, we're seasonal people, right? He was in the chat a minute ago and he left. And it, it, 
He gonna be lit. I, didn't we tell him that the last time we talked to him? This is Desert Suave by Liquid's Imaginaire. I just didn't get to it. I'll try it again in the spring. I think this one is a little light, though. Just a tad bit light. I'm going to put away this one, which is La Belle et Osala by Salvador Dali. I'm going to bring this back out in the spring when I'm trying to be just ridiculously out of control. Out of control. Now, I think I'm going to keep out my... I'm keeping out... Yeah, that's why I've been kind of like... Mm, back and forth on it i might do a swap again who knows um yeah so i have it now because like aphrodisiacs touch definitely staying out love it i'm definitely going to keep out fan your flames because i really need to well i don't know i think fan your flames is a little light for now what do y'all think ani definitely isn't <clears throat> And I'm going to put away my Rosina, my two number six. <clears throat> it's just, it's not, it's not going to be. Rosina, my two number six is not for super cold weather. And the reason why I say that, even though it's a good long lasting one, I just think it just isn't going to project out. And I think it's going to be kind of eaten up by the, the cold. Then we have these two I'm going to take off. Sorry, y'all. Try not. Let me just get up. All right. So these are the last ones. I'm. I think I'm taking off. I think I'm gonna keep Nova Neon because I've been wearing Nova Neon. It's been just serving serving it up for me. But I think I'm gonna put away. I'm gonna watch Sunshine. I mean, Sunshine Woman. Not because I think it can't, because this will actually wear really well at this time of year. But I was wearing, I'm, I was doing my apricots. And I have another one that I think I'm going to wear right now. So I'm going to put this one away. So I'm going to put this one away. And then I'm putting these away. These are Nobel 1942. This is Cafe Chantant because this is a delicate cherry blossom. No, they don't do well this time of year. And I'm put away Casta Diva. It's just a little too candy-like. And I'm not feeling that this candy-ish when it's cold outside. You know, candies for, you know, candy for me is sort of um, spring. Uh, if it's this one, not in the summer because they can be a little cloying, but spring and fall, I, you know, I want to smell like somebody's candy, nibble on me, munch me up. I'm, I'm going to let that one laugh. I'm going to let that one stay. I'm going to let that one stay. So let me put these away. <laughs> Because I heard, I heard everybody going, did she just say that? I did. I couldn't help it. It just came out. Just please forgive me. Please forgive me. What else do I need to be putting away? Right? Spring fever is real, honey. Yes. Okay. Get the fever. To nibble on me, munch me up, whatever.
All right, so let me come up with something I'm about to tell y'all about to do. Let's see what we're going to do. All right, so here are the first ones I'm going to come up with. And hello, Sarah. How are you? Okay. So let me, so here's the first ones I'm coming up with that I'm adding in to the carousels. This one's getting out. This one's going to be back here. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Hold on. So things that I have left out was Dates Delight by um, House of Wood. Yes, I've still got out Portrait by Amouage. I still got my Scandals out, Le Parfum and Scandal Gold. Still thinking I'm feeling them. But now, so I didn't even take out a whole, whole lot because I just feel like, let's just do what we're doing. So let's see. Okay, so first things first. I have not worn this in forever. And remember how, when I went through my I'm wash phase where I was buying them all the time? This is memoir. Got a good deal on it. Let me spell this again. Because it's been so long since I've worn this one. So I want to give it a little love, a little something in the wintertime. Yeah. Why have I not worn this one? Oh, MG. What have I been thinking of? What? Bitch. It's got a powderiness to it. It's got some... Oh, my goodness. Honey, I don't know what... This is Memoir by Amouage, Memoir Woman. Why have I not been wearing this? Memoir Woman by Amouage. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. Mm. I don't know why I have been wearing this. She's got a little powdery essence to her. Some nice, beautiful florals. Mm. A little sweetness. Not too sweet. Oh, I don't know thinking of all right because i tried this on and now i love it cocaine and we know this bitch is going this hoe um is not going anywhere what's a good musk powdery soapy um a good powdery one if you want a real if you want to just go straight powdery go get a rouge by um atar collection that's the most powdery thing i have and it's giving you it feels like you just took a powder puff and puffed yourself with it um oh my god damn this is good okay so yeah cocaine is coming out because now i really like this one mm, mm, mm. Yes, cocaine, honey. Yes, cocaine. I'm saying I better stop saying that before the YouTube hears that keeps sticking. I'm getting high on cam on camera and shit. Because TikTok, I had to like they almost kicked me off for this one. Um anyway. Amore Cafe. Yes, we gotta pull it out. We got to pull it out. We have it. Amore Cafe. Okay. Yes. This coffee drink is. Oh, yes. Yes. And then Rochelle's going to say yes to this one. This is Dolce Amalfi. So we're going to put on it, you know, because this one, oh, this was going to hold its own. This one's going to hold its own, baby. It's going to hold its own. And then I'm going to get some Kai ones out. So I'm going to do Rebirth of Slick. Because this is like plum and tobacco. So I'm going to try this one out for a little bit. Give it a little smokiness. Okay. See how, this, how I'm feeling about that. There will always be a U. Which is the one that I. The sea salt. The salty caramel.
the salty caramel one yes honey yes and then justify your love which is the pistachio one and who and as i have it the pistachio was pistachio and it's oh yes child yes 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 Oh, yes. Now I have um some newer things that we're gonna put out. Then we have so then we got those. We're gonna keep those out. Mm -hmm. Oh, I was gonna put um the other side of Oud up. So I'm putting the other side of Oud up by um Atkinson's and keeping out her mat the Ood save the queen so i'm gonna keep out Ood save the queen because i've been feeling that little earl gray tea orange blossom goodness yes i'm loving it i am loving it but i will really let's do some other things though all right so we have that i want to pull this out but i gotta find something i'm gonna put this chop on it Y'all, I've been feeling a plum thing, and I'm about to pull this out. I'm, I'm, uh, how many are in the carousel? I don't know. I have to count them out. I'm doing better. I'm not gonna put it, put, fill them totally up. Um, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I don't count. I don't count. I just, I know I'm not putting, I'm not stuffing the carousels like I used to. Like just put so many things on there that is just overwhelming. So what I'm doing is looking at it and just making sure that I have a good amount and it gives me some choices right gives me a few choices I de I'm definitely keeping out Behold Patchouli by Gallagher because it has a nice oomph to it I'm going to keep out Nirvana and James Rose um, I mean uh, Nirvana Rose mainly because I like to let, I've been layering this with other roses, especially with these like more edgy roses that I've been doing. Works really well with them. All right, so we got that. Now, let's see what else we're going to put up in here. Uh, let's see what else we want to put in here. I was going to put Kata Night. I don't have a cherry one. We'll put Kata Night in. Yep. All right. Caltech Night is by Atar Collection. So we're going to put this one out. And then, oh, Pure, Sh Pure Jasmine is by Trisardi. Tr and then I need a, I'm, I need my good, I need to wear me, a, I need to have me a couple of good florals out, other than tuberose, right? Because I will, I will default to tuberose. So I'm going to put a Chinto overdose out. Mm. Who is something about this, this little floral just does it for me. So I'm going to put that one out. And now I do have some newer stuff. Shh, 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 shh. All right, I think I've hit what I want to do. I don't think I want to put out too much right now. Then if I feel like I want to make any changes. So, Fan Your Flames is an interesting fragrance for me because I don't necessarily, I'm still challenged by it, but whenever I wear it, I get a lot of compliments. It's a very interesting fragrance for me.
because I do get a lot of compliments. And I'd be like, really? Huh. Okay, so then I feel like I need to have another floral out. And I know some of y'all are so tired of me pulling this bitch out. This hoe out every year. But this is Shanghai Tang's Black Iris. Y'all know. Y'all know. That this is one of my let's do it up. This is one of my favorites, favorites, favorite florals. See what I'm saying? Because that's a power. If you want to wear a floral in the winter, I do, I do. And this, but like honestly, if you want to wear a, fl a floral during this winter time, this is a good one. Cause honey, it ain't going nowhere. It's gonna swirl around you. You gonna smell like a little. You gonna smell so good. People gonna be like, "Whoa, you smell so good." Now I do have the Baracat Gentle Gold. And I've I've kept out uh Barakat Satin Oud because I really like this as like a very lightweight powdery oud for me. Uh no, not all my scents gonna perform well in the cold. They're not. Some of this stuff is going to be sucked into the vortex of the windshield factor. Right? I do too. So it's such a good one. Um and then we have Barakat Gentle Gold. So I'm trying to decide what I'm going to do with this one. Mm. And I need to pull out some. Oh, but you know what I want to do? Is I need to pull out a few Middle Easterns. Give my Middle Eastern some love. Because I ain't got no out. out Because I was trying not to. Because like last year, I was like, Middle Eastern, Middle Eastern. Um, so I've been trying to like do a balance. But I think I do need to pull out a couple more. No, but it's like a very soft, I mean, it's a strong fragrance, but it's a very soft fragrance and, and it's strong yet very soft and girly. So that's what I mean by that. So should I be pulling this one out? I think I, think I know what I want to do with this one though. Mm. All right. Then I have this. I'm about to pull this out because I'm just in the mood for her. Black Musk by, by um by the body shop. Just because sometimes I just want to smell old school sexy because body shop black musk is old school sexy to me. I know it ain't for everybody, but for me, she old school sexy. And then I'm going to be pulling out this one that I just got, which is from Sugar Mama, which is honeyed apricot ambrosia. It is what it says it is. It is spiced apricot with a little musk. It dries down with a little sand with a little musk. This is so delicious. And I'm in a delicious mood. I want to be delicious. Just delicious. And coffee addict. Because I was just given this one, and this is a really good one to, um, you know, use to amp up a little coffee. And then I got the French coffee that I just got. Whew, it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. And then what else do I have? So I think that's it. I think this is everything I'm going to put out for now. I'm going to let it roll. Oh, where is Man Trap? Man, you're right. Man Trap. Where is she? Oh, it's up there. I meant to grab it. Thank you, Sabrina. Man Trap is there. You're right. Man Trap has to come out too. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Because I don't know. It's the season. I need to. I need to trap something. <laughs> I'm sorry. I couldn't help myself. So. I know y'all like to hear these stories about my grandkids sometimes, but I got a, I got a new story for you. 
I have decided. I Kari's birthday is coming up, so I got. I want to get him a birthday present. I'm gonna get him his hunters because he like you know he loves his hunter boots and he's about to he about to, his foot, foot his toes about to bust out of his the ones he have now. So I'm gonna get him a new pair of hunters. But what I really want to get him is a drum set because all of a sudden Kari is a drummer. Listen, y'all, I should I, I might film. Kari, no, Kari's going to be four. So Kari, Bakari has decided that, um, yeah, so this is his thing now. He gets a folding chair. He takes a folding chair. He sits on the folding chair because, you know, his father, let me say this. Um, his father was on the drum line when he was in college. Did y'all, that's it. Some of y'all, I've told y'all that he was on the drum line. So he's got drumsticks. So he's got his father, he's got his daddy's drumsticks, right? So he gets the drumsticks out and then he has a folding chair and his, um, I'm actually going to put, put the drum, drum kit down here. And so he, cause I want him to play. And so he gets the drum, he gets, he gets the drumsticks, he gets a folding chair. He takes one of the chairs for, um, he then takes, a uh, um, he takes the one of the chairs in the kitchen, you know, because it's got a, a um, cushion. He takes that, you know, it's a high chair because you know we got the bar height table. So he he going he got that. So first, that's all he was doing, right? So he was beating on that, watching his little show, singing, right? Now, first off, the thing with Kari, let me give y'all the scenario for Kari. So for Kari, this is what he does. Whenever Kari comes in the house, he undresses at the door. When Kari walks in the door on a regular day, he undresses. He takes off his boots, his socks, his pants are coming, his jacket, his pants are coming off. He's going to be in his drawers and his t-shirt within five minutes of coming in the door. This is the way Kari is. He, he undresses at the front door every day. That's what he does. And then he he's in, right? Well, something about him drumming, he needs to be in full clothes. So, so yesterday when he started doing this, he came, he so you know, that's his thing. So now Kari decided he needed two drums. So he was first beating on the chair, but and, and it has the um, you know, it's a cushion on the chair. So it's you know, he ain't making no noise. Then he decided he needed another one, right? So he took the little rocking horse that they have in the house. You know, one of them little plastic rocking horses they would play around on. He decided that was going to be his, his other one. So he went and dragged that, and he has it on the side of him. And so he's playing both of them. And he got one on here, and he's just playing. He's playing. Now, here's the thing about this. Kari came straight in today, and now he sets it up. Hi, Man Manny, twenty eighteen. He sets it up. He got a, it's a, it's a whole thing. He got to set up his little drum set, right? Got to get his little thing together. So he sets it all up. But for him to do that, he got to be in full clothing. So Kari been was up for the came straight in, and was in all of his clothes, boots and all. Kept his hat on, with this on. Now, the other thing is, Kari likes to look at himself when he does things a lot. So then Kari decides, because he was in the kitchen, not bothering nobody, right? Living his best life. I'm good. You know, he's, he would call me Gigi. Yeah, Kari. Look at, you know, he want me, you, you doing it, man. He's like, you see what I'm doing? I see you, man. Go and keep playing. This was a conversation down the hall from the, in, from the living room. So he's doing this little thing here and there. But then he decides, I can't see myself. I need to see myself. So, in order for him to see himself when he's downstairs, Kari likes to close the door, my my basement door, and look at himself in the in the glass. So he drags all this stuff into the middle of the hallway so he can sit there and see himself playing. Congratulations! What's his name? So then he dra drags it all in, in, in the menu. And then he got to have his hat on because he's, he's, he's in performance mode. So performance mode means that he got to have all his clothes on, shoes on, 
and his hat on because y'all know the boy love a hat so he got his hat on he he playing and singing he's playing and singing now let me tell you about men let's have a conversation about men as i hold the microphone let me put this down because <laughs> we can't stay, we can't stay focused okay so let me tell you how a man is now Kari ain't bothering nobody he is living his best life okay living his exactly we're about to nurture this brain is on point with me on this one <laughs> thank you thank you um so we already talking about we gonna nurture it uh, we nurturing his because he really loves instruments because you know he has a guitar he plays the guitar too so he gonna learn how to play these instruments because i'm we're gonna nurture his you know musical abilities because he's naturally doing this he's been playing on instruments since he was like one years old he the first time he saw he was given some drums he took the drums and started playing them it was on point so but let me tell you how man is Kari ain't bothering nobody. He got his little setup and everything. Ain't bothering nobody. Brandon decides it's in the way. So then he moves it all into the into the kitchen. Uh, right? So he moves. So Kari kind of moved it into the kitchen for a minute. And Brandon decided the little rocking horse, he shouldn't have that. Well, he, he don't need that. And he took it away from him. So all of a sudden, we sit in the front and Kari flips the fuck out. <laughs> he is screaming. And we're like, what's going on? Now, mind you, he has been in the house chilling for about three hours since the time he came home two and a half three hours he ain't bothering nobody he don't want no juice he ain't asked for no food he is playing his music living his best life and we're like what's wrong what's wrong he's like you know i took you know i moved it he don't need that and then he's like he he don't need that he don't need that and we're like what are you doing we're like Get that boy back the thing. I was like, if you don't get that boy back that thing, because he is freaking out because he done took his damn his 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 extra his other drum piece away. I was like, if you don't get that boy back, because he, you know what I'm saying? When a three-year-old is content and ain't bothering nobody, just got his iPad going, watching his stuff, singing along. He found his stuff to sing along with and play his little drum, his little drum kit. And you gonna take part of his drum kit away, boy? I'm gonna hit you. I mean, cause he it, he was so upset, right? It was like, why are you bothering him? But he and he, he's like, and then he got the nerve to be like, boy, stop! Until we figured out, I was like, what? What? Why? Why is he crying? Well, you know, cause I took put this. Up. He don't need that. What? Why? What's the difference between what why was he bothering you? Was it was it bothering you? No. And the boy was content living his best life, not bothering nobody. And considering that he's a drummer, why would you do that? <laughs> he can't fit the white suit, because I sure would have him in that white suit. Oh Kai, hey, Kai has a sale. Buy one, get one free. Y'all know that, don't you? He just posted it. I got to post it up for you. Buy one, get one free on, on Kai. You should get summertime. That peachy thing. That's the one I want, JC. Summertime and just for my love. And the new one you got out. Exactly. A three to four year old just chilling, not bothering nobody, not into anything. And you could see what they're doing. Because, I mean, I, he was sitting right there like, and you going to disturb that boy's peace. you going to disturb his peace. Don't you have some summertime in, JC? Because you need the summertime. You need summertime. You know, speaking of something, I said I was going to take out one. Um, 
Hold on. Speaking of something. Speaking of something, speaking of something, this is what I wanted to take out. Entice. Drakari, hey, dang, he a big boy. Entice, I'm putting this on a carousel. Oh my goodness. This, mm, 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 mm. I forgot. I forgot about my entice. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Look at how deep and dark it has gotten. <laughs> that's going on the carousel because you know what I thought about I was like why am I not putting my stuff out that I have that I like because I feel like oh people aren't going to know what I'm talking about who gives a damn this is mine this is entice rest in peace rest in peace oh my goodness yes I am wearing it. This is a good. This is a good. This is a good uh, fragrance for floral fragrance for the winter time. You try looking for what, but couldn't find it. Kai fragrances. K H Y E. Ooh, my hands messing up. I might have to go on and get off of here. So, all right. So I picked out everything. It's not too many on the. It's not too many on the carousels this time. I've kept out some things that I want to keep wearing. I need to throw out, throw in a couple of Middle Easterns, right? Okay. Don't nobody care about the hand painted bottle. Don't nobody care about the hand painted bottle. What they care about is what's inside of the bottle. <laughs> that's what we care about let me say that again what's inside of the bottle that's what we care about oh was that asmr or what oh let me do that again we just care about what's inside of the bottle <laughs> This is what you want to look for. This is his new brand, Kai Fragrances. Entice is no longer available. Ray. So if you're looking to purchase for him now, it is Kai Fragrance. There's the name. Let's get this done. Mm. Mm. And I'm telling y'all, if y'all like pistachios, y'all need to go and get this Justify Your Love. You see this, JC? Justify Your Love is... Got a little spice to it. So, and it's an airy pistachio. 
it's an airy fairy pistachio it's airy but not too airy you know what i'm saying like i could wear it now because it's it's got some it's got some levels to it but it's still got enough um oomph to it I know you can't do anything about the ones that you've created for ganache. But we just knowing that you can do a new, we, that's what we're saying. You can do a pistachio gourmand. A pistachio gourmand. And it's going to be delicious. How long is your sale, JC? How long is the sale? I just told you every time, Kaylin, look at what I'm doing. This is his site. I keep, I, I'm like, I keep pulling it up. This is the site, love. How long is the uh, sale, JC? Because I didn't see a date, a uh, 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 end date on it. Wait, how do you get the sale? How do you get the sale, JC? Do you just put two things in and then you, you charge for one or something? How's it work? I just saw you posted it up on your Instagram and I threw it up. I didn't, I didn't even say. Ooh, yes. I remember, I remember loving this. Yeah. Yes, I'm going to start. All right, y'all. Oh, I'm about to go to sleep. I'm getting sleepy. I was, did I tell y'all I was babysitting today, Blake? infant babysitting is so easy all you gotta do is hold them on your chest and let them sleep and feed them and change their diaper it was like the most relaxing babysitting but we just watched i've been watching uh married to real estate with egypt sharad faith i almost text you asking you about the, the places she was going all around in georgia i was like i should be texting what about this neighborhood <laughs> What about this neighborhood? Oh, I need to get ready to do this one. All right, y'all. I'm about to get off of here because I'm going to take a nap. And I'm going to get up early and I'm going to film a little something. And then I need to do some cleaning. And then I'm going to film a little more. Because I go back to work. I go back to work on Monday. And I'm not going to complain because I had two weeks off. Hey. You know, sometimes we be forgetting how good it is. I had two weeks off. I was just chilling. All right. So if thank you all for hanging out as always. We had a good time. <sighs> Talk to you later. <laughs>